<clears throat> just really a, a hard fought game for our, our team. I, we had a we had tremendous respect for Seton Hall coming in. And we had tremendous respect for Seton Hall. I think they have a terrific team. Uh, we, we played terrific defense. Yeah, I thought that our defense and rebounding is what won us the game. And we have unbelievable respect for Seton Hall. They're, they're a terrific team. And I thought over the two-week break, you know, I went back and forth. And at the end, I thought, you know what, I'm glad we're playing a really good team because it forced our guys to be on point uh, when the game started. And um, I was really pleased with our defense. Coach, uh, uh, the transition game was uh, – you, you used the cliché, run the other team out of the gym. It seemed like you guys had a lot of energy and were not just beating them back on fast break, but getting back on defense and a lot of quickness out. Yeah, you know, our team is fresh. I mean, you give us two weeks to prepare for somebody, we ought to know what we're doing, you know. And and we didn't we – didn't, I think we practiced three days, take a day off, three days, take a day off. We had some days – one day the assistant coaches ran practice, one day I turned their music on, you know. Uh, one day we scrimmaged and just tried to keep it fresh, uh, but our legs were fresh. And um, you know, outside of Nemi, who's had the flu this week, um, I thought the rest of them had really good energy. Is that the reason for Yante's start? Yeah, Nemi, Nemi's just had the little virus or whatever, and missed, a, missed a practice and a half this week. And, and as you can tell, wasn't himself, but um, you know, cer certainly was proud of our team. I saw Kenny do a around the back rainbow dunk in pregame warmups. I was thinking, well, he should be okay for the game. Uh, you know, really the whole thing with Kenny was how fast could we get the range of motion back, which took, you know, I think nine days. And once he got the range of motion back, he's got some pain. And probably with the adrenaline, didn't feel it. And they've said they're going to have some pain that's going to be there because you got a bone bruise in there. Uh, but, but, you know, he practiced um, pretty well on Thursday. Um, and, uh, and we felt like he would... You know, we felt he'd been through it before, obviously. His first game came out and didn't handle it as well. This time he handled it much better. There was some thought that after the Colorado game, finally getting that type of non-conference victory, that you know it could kind of lift you all, push you all forward. I know there was a two-week break, but did you kind of see that effect a little bit here? Well, <clears throat> I, I think that the win over Colorado gave us some confidence. You know, confidence is such a fragile thing. It's such an important thing. I thought it gave us some confidence, and I just wasn't. And we were driving to church this morning. My wife says, "Man, you're really grumpy." And I said, "I got a game tonight." And I was grumpy yesterday with these guys, and I just wasn't going to let us have a letdown, you know. And, and um, I think they felt. I think we felt like we have a good team now, uh, but we have a good team if we play the right way. And tonight we played the right way because we beat a very good team. What, what is uh, JJ doing there in terms of ball handling, and uh, I guess mostly taking care of the ball and, and distributing? Well, he leads us in rebounding tonight. Eleven rebounds for a guy that's, you know, five foot two. You know, um, he, he really is playing terrific. You know, he, he he's really playing terrific. Outside of the lob, you know, straight up down the boards to Kenny Gaines, which was a poor decision. He, he really is playing well. He he's got great instincts and feel for the game. He can shoot it. He's hard to guard with his speed, uh, and uh, he's really, uh, I think, playing confidently. And he's certainly more comfortable than he was as a freshman. Any more questions? The uh, defensive rebounding also was pretty strong against Colorado. I mean, Marcus has been doing what he's been doing all year. Who else, what, it, what in your mind has contributed to that? You know, t tonight I think it was by committee. We, we felt like, and we told our guards going in, you guys are going to have to chase some down tonight. And, you know, obviously J.J. did. Uh, Charles, you know, he, he's been good for us on the glass. Uh, it, we, we felt like it was going to have to be a team effort on the glass, which I think we got. What's the 